All right, we're going to do a little bad company for you. Um, again, this is the campfire version of it. No distortion allowed. Okay, we're playing acoustic guitar. If you like making love. Okay, you all remember the classic beginning? Okay, that is played thusly. Okay, grab you an F chord, okay? It's nowhere near there. Now we gotta take this way up here. Okay, so where your finger was, this finger, where it was, let me turn this light out of the way so maybe you can actually see my guitar. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> okay, anyway, so where your finger was here on the first fret, take that whole chord, slide it all the way up, so that you actually end up with your first finger here on the 10th fret, okay? And 11th fret on the G string and 12th fret, so with the double dots here, on the D string. This is the way we're gonna do this, okay? So we're going all the way up here. This is actually just a D chord. It's just shaped like an F. But we're bringing it all the way up as far as you can on a guitar that does not have a cutout. So you'll be all the way at the top of your guitar if you have this. So just an F chord, move it up 10th, 11th, 12th fret. So same thing. So just one, two, two times. Just listen to it. Okay, so twice. Now move it down two whole frets. Then down it, down. Get rid of the hang nail here. Give me two seconds. Yeah, I don't use editing. <laughs> editing for editors. I'm a picker. Okay, so then down two frets. So down up, down. And then we do a D chord. This is actually G, but it's just like a D chord, but we're bringing it up here so that your two fingers are on the seventh frets of the G and high E string. Then you put your middle, or your ring finger actually, but in the middle of them, there at the eighth fret. So you do down, down, then add your pinky to the eighth fret, then take your pinky back off. So we hear exactly how they're strummed. Okay, so that one's. So down, down, up. Add your pinky down, then off. So. Then, same thing. So by the time you get to the last, you'll bring that D chord up here, which is actually G, but you bring it down to the D position. Okay? So again. simple. Um, the chords are going to be very easy from there. Here's the second time. So D, G, D, and G. Real basic strumming. G, G and D and G. Here's where it switches. Okay, for that. Okay, so we're going to do C really quick. C, D, D. So C down, kill it. And up on the D. 
So C, D is just that quick. And down on the D. So both of them are killed really fast. C, D, stop it. Then, again. Three times, then C, G. Then do it again. Back it up and we'll go right to it. Back to your DG thing. Okay, here it comes. Here it goes. CD. stuff we can try but D and G back and forth all day long. The fun part was the beginning. Here we go. C D C D C D C D C D C G C D C D C D C G C D C play with it again at the very beginning remember just all the way up an F chord all the way up to the 10th 11th 12th fret then bring it all down two frets then do like a D chord but with your two fingers or the seventh fret then again then we'll start with our D and our G D and a G and a D and a G here we go. Um, full volume, it's all you.
company if you like making love such a cool tune and of course now you get an electric throw some distortion just on that one part and you can actually use bar chords <laughs>